What's up guys? It's chow time again and this is my Phantom 4 backpack. I have my Phantom 4 in here when I travel and a few other uh, little things, batteries, uh, small camera and whatnot, but this is what I look like. Alright, this thing is big. It, uh, it takes up a lot of space. I have two bags of equipment when I check into an airplane. I basically have this and a small carry-on which carries around little accessories, uh, my GoPro, chargers, extra batteries, all those kind of things. What is today's video about? It is about the DJI Mavic Pro. I can't say I'm not excited and disappointed at the same time. And here's why. The DJI Phantom 4 was announced in March. I bought it in July, right around my birthday. And uh, we're in September, not uh, July, August, September. Yeah, two, two, uh, two, three months later, the DJI Mavic Pro was announced just, just yesterday. Uh, this is a week after GoPro announced their uh, drone, their Karma drone. And when they announced it last week, when GoPro announced their Karma last week, I was just like, yeah, that's kind of cool that it folds up, it's compact, it's nice, you can travel with it just about anywhere. Uh, it fits conveniently in most backpacks. It comes with a backpack, but um, if you don't like that backpack, you can shove it into a different backpack. But the point is, it's small, convenient, small and convenient. You can take it with you anywhere, so you don't miss out on those shots. And it's not, it doesn't require something like this, right? This is big. So, with the announcement of the Mavic Pro yesterday, my jaw hit the floor, man. That thing is so awesome. Again, I can't say I'm not a little bit disappointed that I just got my, I just got my, my Phantom 4. I just got it like a couple months ago and now I feel like it's obsolete. There's, there's a few more things about this uh, uh, that I like that uh, the Mavic Pro um, doesn't have, uh, for example, you know, it's got the, the wider angle on it, and I think the gimbal, both have a uh, three-axis gimbal, but I think this one does a better job of uh, keeping the footage stable, uh, based on the footages that I've seen so far. Um, I really like, I love my DJI Phantom 4. It, you know, it's, it's huge, but I do take it with me everywhere I go. Um, but with the release of, or the announcement of the Mavic Pro yesterday, it got me thinking, <laughs> man, I just bought this thing, but I'm, I'm wanting the Mavic Pro, man. It's, can you imagine? Like, I don't have to lug around that huge backpack anymore. I can fit like, like that in a little pouch on my belt and, and just basically clip it onto uh, my belt and, and go anywhere. Be, have this thing accessible to me. Uh, get all the footages that I really want. The best part about it really is this, you know, with, with this, it's it's really easy with the Phantom 4. Uh, I think with the Phantom 3, 2, and the original Phantom, uh, there's you have to twist these propellers on and spin them around till they lock, I, I think. I don't own one, so I don't know. But it, it's uh, with the Phantom 4, it's a lot easier to put the propellers on and, and go. So that's a huge improvement. Uh, but with the Mavic 4, or the Mavic Pro, Everything is already attached. You just transform that little thing. It, it looks awesome. And I'm really torn. Like, I think I might get it, but man. So this is the closest thing that I could find that, that looks about the same size. It's a charging station or a charging dock for uh, PlayStation 4 controllers. And look at the size difference, right? I think the Mavic Pro is about this size based on what I've seen um, in, in videos and pictures on the internet. Uh, it, it's about this size and the wings fold and they tuck under and um, it's just awesome. Look at this size difference. This is this is about what it, it I think it is, uh, the size of it compared to this beast right here. This beast does a lot. I love it. But I think I'm gonna love the Mavic Pro even more. I don't have one with me. Obviously, it just it was just announced yesterday, and I believe it doesn't go on sale until uh, late October or something like that. But 
Got to save up my pennies, man. <laughs> Got to save up my pennies. The karma, the karma looks awesome, but it's a whole like ecosystem of, or it's a whole system of equipment, right? You get like the, uh, the, the handheld thing, um, the, the gimbal, you can detach from the drone, hook up your GoPro 4 or 5 uh, to it, and it's, it's this whole system. I don't, I don't think I need that, that system. Frankly, I really don't need another drone either, but the Mavic Pro is portable. You can take it anywhere with you. It, it's, it's inconspicuous. You have it on you and nobody will never, no, no one will ever know you have a drone on you. That's the beauty of it. Anyway, that's my little uh, talk on the Phantom or the drones. I gotta save up my money. <laughs> Thanks for watching, guys. I'll, uh, I'll keep you updated on, on what I decide. Give it a thumbs up, all right? Please subscribe if you haven't. Thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next one. Bye.